Hey, look, it's uh, Pro Evolution, Joe. It's shiny. It's really nice. It's uh, It's got a decent menu here, which is... That's new. How about that? Uh, Tomorrow, what do you think of the menu? It's very uh, flashy. It's got, got the neon lights. Uh, okay, choose your team. This is very important. Do you want to be Barcelona or Bayern Munich? Um, I'll, I'll play yourself. Bayern. I'm going to be Barcelona. Oh, man, you didn't show all like the really horrible icons and stuff that no, I used to have. No, check this out, though. Watch the game plan menu. Look at it. Look look how easy uh, to understand it, it is. Too <laughs> Leave to manage your uh, offensive. Okay. This is what happens when they allow Japanese Next. people to design menus. Next. Hey. But look, you can do this. This is this is <laughs> pretty funky. Look, <laughs> if I want, I could just take um, Sergio Biscuits and move him over here. Or up here. What Check it hell? out. Someone's yeah. been playing with the iPhone. Well, if you can move him outside that white box, what's the point of the white box? Check it out. It's like a it's like a, a guideline, I guess. So this is like position notation change if you move him outside that box or something. Hey, let's play the game. No. You don't even know how, do you? You're stuck in the menu. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> Kick off. Oh, the, here's the thing I was talking about. This is the... It's like a stock photo. It's not even the game, but it's supposed to look like the game. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is the screenshot. That's genius. Yeah. I never even got that. Yeah, this, these are the um, fake loading screens to mask the fact that it's actually loading. I really like Poyol's nose. I know. It's really big. I, lo I love this freeze. It looks like you're, It looks like it's crashed, but it hasn't. So this is Pro Ev. It's uh, very different to the old Pro Ev. They've rebuilt it from the ground up. Um, and I kind of like it. It's with this uh, camera angle. Yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? Or is it supposed to be broadcast quality or something? It's very nice. If there's any if there's any visual lag on this, it's because of our capture. Um, we we tend to have a little problems with the PlayStation sometimes. Uh, so don't be too pissed off about it. But uh, I'm gonna kick Joe's ass. So I would you like don't to have to worry about it. If this is anything like FIFA yesterday, he will not kick my ass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a terrible foul. Apparently. Now what happens? So I've discovered the slide tackle button. All right. So they got animations in this. That's, that's not, the that's exact not same one as the one in the last Pro Evo. It's kind of weird. It's uh, It looks good though. It looks better on this screen than it did it on the, the other screen. I still don't believe that this is a new engine. Passing and the lobbing in this game are way less assisted than they than they at least appeared to be in, oh, the, in the previous Pro Evo game. The um, the, that little bar underneath your, your player when you're kicking the ball is um, far more sensitive than it is in, in past games and in, in even in the new, f well, the World Cup FIFA game. Um, the passing is like Instead of just being able to tap it and it automatically goes to the player you're pointing towards, it's, uh, it's very much dependent on how much you hold down that ball. So if I like try and pass it out here and like tap it, it'll go out slowly and you have to stop. Whereas if I roof it to somebody close and go, oh, that wasn't the best example, I'll be honest. God, I'm bad at this. You're pretty shit. Sergio Biscuits there. I'm so FIFA's so ingrained on my mind. I just can't cope with this at all. I'm just really hoping we had a goal in here. Let's see what happens. I think the only goal when we played yesterday was the AI. <laughs> this <laughs> could go badly. It's true. Uh, oh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Xavi has it. What a touch. Uh, sounds in these games are always hard to judge from demos because they tend to be very the restrictive. The um, there's no commentary, obviously, but there isn't a the full game. Uh, what else is in it? There's the Champions League is in it as usual. The Europa League, Europa League is in it. I think uh, there's a Mexican Cup as well. But I think it's the Me Mexican League. Is, uh, is in it as well. Um, I wonder if Arsenal's in it this year. That's always the deal breaker for me as, as an Arsenal fan. Is it North London this year or is it... I think it depends on who's in the Champions League normally because of that licence. Oh, really? So All right. I Possibly. believe it's still well, then North we're in. London. The character models look better, but the game overall still oh, seems kind of... I don't know what about FIFA. There is. Oh no, if you, it, it, it doesn't look as good as FIFA, but it definitely problem, looks better than, yeah. than last mm. year's one. Last it's year's an one animation ass. issue being that it... Um, Pro Evo is still all mocap, and yeah. FIFA is um, like procedurally generated. Yeah, and they string them together a lot better as well. Although the motion, ooh, mm. that was close. Although the the animation in this is far better, isn't it? And the way that they it is better, but the running, if you look carefully, the running is still really like grid based and diagonal, like it always has been. You can't. The turning isn't like circular. It's not 360 degrees like mm. the FIFA. It's still on eight. Yeah. Skippy, skippy. Victor Valdez. Uh, we got a penalty in the last match, and the camera angle didn't change from regular broadcast. It was like, but it this. still does the free kicks, which is kind of weird. It was so strange. It meant, meant that I wasn't really sure which way I was supposed to save uh, the ball. Was I supposed to hit up or down or left and right? And in the end, he just stuck it in the goal. Offside, bitch. Uh, you in the new FIFA game to talk about a game we're not playing. <laughs> uh, you can put in your own. 
come at uh, custom chants custom and, chants, which you could uh, in and the previous walk on prior. music I think as well and if you walk on music like Titan Trons wow that's a, that, that is a defensive no no right there oh I have not learnt this game at all and that was an offensive um, route and no, you can no. have like you can be all uh, Burnley and Wigany if you want and have um, have your crazy music that plays after you score goals and stuff oh, like yeah. that as well oh yeah <laughs> 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 Da, 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 da. That's great. Can you can you share? Does that mean you can make racist ones like they have in in most football Are clubs as well? Are you saying in uh, Virtual Striker Two, if you play Saudi Arabia, the fans like there's like the call to prayer with all the music and everything what? in the stadium. It is really racist. That's really <laughs> terrible. Oh my god! Uh, yeah, but I, gu I guess not I a good climate to do that in. No, I, gu I guess you can though. <laughs> <laughs> it's doable. It's good. It's is there a compilation of these things, please? Because there's um, MP3s on um, some of the Pro Evo websites. For the, for the previous games yeah but the audio is always a really weird level so it never quite worked I tried to do it with my United channel what it's like a random dudes ones uh, yeah, yeah United have their own song when they come out yeah the they? Manchester United Calypso <laughs> which is what? a song about the Matt Busby team from the 60s but Calypso it's like, is there like, like it's like coconuts crazy. in the background it and may like, as well be I shall like, play it for you later like, and you will like have steel, many laughs steel drums <laughs> <laughs> pretty <laughs> much it is pretty much like embracing that. Uh, United's Jamaican roots all of it <laughs> then we'd easily get loads of multiplayer games but because like oh here oh we go God. I'm going to shut the fuck up now there he is and he has to get the fuck oh. in I don't know why I'm so enthusiastic I'm no celebrations Iniesta doesn't even really carry his board <laughs> uh, thing. today's goals one <laughs> 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 playing online has become a big thing for you particularly yeah big time in, uh, playing football games online do you think you can yeah I think Konami go. traditionally haven't been very good with their neck Konami generally Japanese are kind of iffy with online at the moment this is really and hard Konami to particularly are horrible at on most online stuff I can't think of a game where the online has been really good from the outset and the problem is you have to buy the game to figure that out yep um, so is that, is that I do think be I'm going to get both I think I'm going to give Pro Ev the benefit of the doubt this year and at least give it a go and try it on, on launch um, yeah, I think I am. I kind of like the weight, though. I don't. Know, maybe it's just. Did you uh, do what? that? No, I did not do that. Oh, that's because I set it to automatic managing at the start. Okay, that. Oh, and he's also changed formation, and now we're at four two two two. That was interesting as well. They're showing the managers, but they were like generic managers. They weren't. Yeah. Was, oh oh my days. wow! Stuck Zilla. See, I say that because it's weird. Well, I I I'd consider it weird where where most people wouldn't would pick a side and stick to it whereas you're saying you're thinking about buying both games yeah so it seems like you've got your main you want something that you, you're familiar with and you're good at and then you want something slightly different I guess even it if it necessarily isn't as good as the other game yeah well I guess it depends how like competitive you are with your game because for instance like there's nothing that stops me from playing two first person shooters online like I'll, I'll play Battlefield and I'll play Modern Warfare but when it comes to football games I guess if you're trying to get good at them I can understand why you'd sink a lot more time into it but otherwise why not play two big Probably The other games? thing is that two football games are trying to do the same thing two first person shooters might be trying to achieve something very different yeah, that's yeah, very good Battlefield point. and COD are very very different types of games oh. whereas FIFA and Pro they're kind yeah, of it's the very same. similar but like their differences may not be intentional That's well, part yeah. of the problem these days as well is that they were very different, although they were both football games. They were very different ten or twelve years ago. Now yeah. they're basically FIFA used copying to be the arcade. best bits of one another to some extent. FIFA used to be all about arcade, and it's just simply not anymore. Uh, I cannot do this game at all. You know what? I'm seeing a pattern here. I'm enjoying the game, and I'm winning. <laughs> <laughs> and you didn't like it, uh, and you lost. So yeah, jury's out on FIFA. I think it's going to be interesting. This game is now for a month, and this demo is going to be out for the month that it's not out so that should be interesting people get a feeler for it uh, but yeah that's uh, that's Pez I'm definitely getting both give it a go it's changed enough for me Joe? A FIFA for me still I think you going to give this a complete pass? Uh, maybe I'll end up doing what I did this year later in the year I might give it a try again but not nowhere near launch I don't think Tomorrow? Yeah, I'm sticking with FIFA 